After months of emotional turmoil and public appeals, Dotu ex wife has finally granted Dotu the assets he sought for to see his children. But people don't be small matter. She shared a heartfelt message on her platform where she clarified that the issue was never about you know denying Dotu the assets to see his kids, but rather the manner in which he had pursued it. But before I commence with the full J's, welcome to Orange TV, a platform where we we'll give you updated news and trading latest matters happening in the world of social media. So if you have not already, do subscribe to our YouTube page. And don't forget to like, share, turn notification bell to get notified when else we drop more trending latest gist. To all our massive subscribers, thank you so much for your massive support. We do not take this for granted. And to all our viewers, feel relaxed, enjoy, and stay tuned. In a recent development, Dotu took to social media to express his concern and frustration regarding the incident involving his ex wife refusal to allow him to their children. So he went on to reveal that he overheard someone stating that his ex wife would go a great length, even to the extent of you know preferring to buy my people <laughs> you know be small but rather than allowing dotu to have access to their children and this shocking revelation left dotu in deep concern about their children well-being hey my people the matter serious honestly and dotu concomat contact say he has the american passport of their children and he believes that this may be the reason why he hasn't lost complete contact with his kids moreover he has received information indicating that his ex-wife is determined to defy court order and disobey the law. So she vowed that no court or legal system will force her to allow daughter to see their children. <laughs> My people, hey, trouble they sleep, younger go wake up. So this determination on her own part left Dotu worried about the impact on his relationship with his kids. So he has expressed the commitment to fight for justice and the right to see his children, even if it means, you know, putting his own life on the line. Hey, <laughs> my people, no bit small matter. This thing they pain, shall he they pain, my people. For somebody to tell you, say you no get access to your children, ah, he they hurt. This can lead to depression, you know. So, Dr. Nankoma has come and answer his further action, saying that he's ready to take legal step against the American embassy. And he also addressed them directly via social media. He tagged the Nigeria police force and the immigration office in his post, where he clarified that his sole request was the three months of the year that the court had granted him to spend holidays and festive season with his children. Now, my people, the matter no end there. Dr. went ahead to call out the branch. You know, his ex wife's brother for supporting her sister's action and even went ahead to threaten Dotu. So, Dotu issued a 24 hour settlement for access to his kids, which was not granted. So, that prompted him to voice his frustration online and threaten to escalate the matter to the relevant authorities. Because, as it stands now, Dotu revealed that his ex wife forcefully changed their children's school and address in apparent effort to, you know, keep Dotu away from his children so this situation ignited a strong public response my people with many people voicing their opinion that children should not suffer the consequences of their parents divorce or separation and they went on to emphasize that the importance of parents prioritizing their children will be over personal dispute is not right at all this life gets us to be honestly you see a man fighting to turn it to see his kid and some other women are begging their ex-husband to come see their children hey <laughs> my people this life no balance because most times who gets cap do get head and who gets complete head no get cap now so it be but thank god say after months of you know emotional turmoil and public appeals Dotu ex-wife don't finally grant Dotu the access he sought to see his children. <laughs> My people don't be smart thing because she shared a heartfelt message on her social media platform where she clarified that the issue was never about denying Dotu the access to see his kids, but the manner in which he had posted it. So she acknowledged that certain rules had been breached, but she has allowed Dotu to see their kids thanks to illegal proceeding initiated by Dotu's team. In Dotu ex wife lengthy post, she said that Dotu could, you know, indeed see their children if he chose to. But she laid down one important condition saying that Dotu must keep their children's address off social media. Let me put up a small matter because many people have been saying that Dotu is not shameless, that he's giving too much information about his family and he talks too much, blah, blah, blah. If the woman in question did not deprive Dotu from his case, all this will not be happening. There's a limit to which any woman can take and when the person reaches the break, he or she rules. So this is the breaking point. 
and she never see anything because the two i see is ready to shake everywhere until he sees his kids even if it means disgracing himself and her family or more he doesn't care the significant development was preceded by a revelation from Dr. X5, who, you know, bravely shared some aspects of their past marriage, where she disclosed that during their marriage that she faced criticism and belittlement from Dr. So that Dr. allegedly told her that she was inadequate in the bedroom and that he did not enjoy intimacy with her, comparing her unfavorably to others. That got her upset so she admitted that this nearly shattered her self-esteem but asserted that she did not want to use their children as pawns to fight against the troubled marriage they had endured if you go through the slide that Dotu ex-wife posted on her platform Dotu wasn't denied access until he wanted to have them for longer than the period stipulated in court's paper. So this was what caused the whole mess. Actually, there is no way he can have the whole holiday with his kids and their mom has only school days, which is not supposed to be so. But you know how, you know, truth is, it doesn't bend because on Dotu's account of event, it seems more straightforward. So if court granted Dotu shared custody, it means that they found him as a responsible father. So it's better off Dotu to see his kids. Honestly, I feel sorry for Dotu. It obviously seems that she replied to Claire Duban's name. That is her brother's name. But she's saying that Dotu knows where his kids are. Does he have access to them regardless knowing where they are? It's the real question, honestly. If the father is not harmful to the case, why use the case to punish him? Because the same case will grow up and look for their dad, be it male or female. So no matter what happened between husband and wife, the children should not be used as a tool to punish the father or the mother. Allow them to see their kids so they can build a relationship with them since you both have parted ways. So guys, do let us know your thoughts and your opinion contributions are in the comment section. We would love to hear from you. And if you have not subscribed to our YouTube page yet, do us a favor and subscribe. Don't forget to like and turn on the notification bell to get notified when next we drop our video. As I'm sure you don't want to miss out, trending and latest spicy G's happening on social media. Once again, thank you all so much for staying tuned with us. We really do appreciate as we have come to the end of today's segment. Like on your way next. Stay safe guys. Bye.